All right, so welcome back to another uh, a short little monster review. Today we're doing it on the newest Legends Pass monster, the free one, Blackberry. Uh, yep. You get it's a free one, and you get him at um, level thousand point six, uh, six, six point yeah six two, and mm -hmm. he's pretty cool. Uh, he has some good books. Yup. Abyssal, he's the Abyssal. A lot of books. So uh, you know, if you're trying to complete um, some books, then he's very good. And um, yeah, he's pretty. He's pretty cool. Uh, I'll show you guys all. I'll show him all. Uh, he has, he is a uh, nature and metal. He's a nature metal support. And let's look at his traits. Uh, he has tough, which does 35 less accuracy for all stats effects that hit him. Um, that's pretty mid for um for rank one for rank not like just no rank. Uh, rank one, he has mutant torture, which is actually really good. If he got that first, I would probably say that's a little better. And then mutant stun is kind of weak. Like area dodge would have been way better. Also, as mutant stun is also pretty good, but yeah. it can be useful sometimes. Because like attackers like Tubercon and the other uh, Abyssal Pass monster, I'm pretty sure his name is like uh, Alchemist. Oh yeah. He does stun and stuff. Um, his the, strength is good. Legend pass? Of yeah, Legends. Pass. Abyssal, yeah, Pass monsters. Um. Life, he has some. He has some good life for a sport. Yeah, uh, mm -hmm. speed. He has really good speed, actually. Yes. And you don't. You don't even need to put that many runes on him. Stamina is pretty mid, honestly. But you, it's always almost always under an A stamina. Yeah. So it's nothing special. Also, it makes three hundred sixty four gold a minute, which um standard for all mythic monsters. Um, Except, you um, know. But I got one of those enhancer things. So. Right. Uh, I'll show you guys the moves. There's. Mm -hmm. Like, there's multiple ways to run this monster, but this is the right I feel like you should run. Mm -hmm. Um, I put two attack and two, uh, heal and stuff. Support. Uh, Biotite Explosion does moderate metal damage, AoE, AoE damage, with Nail Virus, which is one of the best stats effects out there. Um, it does low metal damage and blocks positive status effects, which is really good, but the only thing I'll complain about is it's really long cooldown for three turns. Yeah, also not very great accuracy. Yeah, the accuracy is really down. It's only moderate too. Yeah. Uh, you're not gonna be doing any damage with this monster, of course. Only people like runes. Uh, Blackberry Cake. This is a really good AOE because it removes all control stats effects from an ally and does double damage regen. Regen for three turns and double damage is really good. Although some monsters, some support monsters have triple damage, so. And also remove your uh, AK um forge lives. So it's not the best in terms of damage, in terms of a damage buffer, but it does bring some more to the table, like invasive species, which deals moderate special damage. So basically, special damage um, is it's not. It's like the it's like anything. yes, yeah. I mean weak type thing, and also gives nanovirus for three turns and poison, which is really good because mm -hmm. uh, with the and with the virus you also get poison, which is more damage. Yes. And their power and their strength is reduced, which is really good. Mm -hmm. And it's one of the it's one of the attacks where it only has really it's one of the attacks that only has. Uh, minimal cooldown mm -hmm. would be better if I had no cooldown. Like uh, the move right. right here. If you um, these are two spam moves you can run if you want to do uh, like attacker mm -hmm. and blackberry juice. It removes all tortures too. I'm pretty sure the other one does too. No, all control effects, which is yes. good. Tortures are like uh, possession and stuff. Yeah. No, tortures there's fire and control it's is. It's like all uh, damage, damage, uh, negative effects. Like nano virus. Um, and also gives damage boost to all allies, which is really good. It gives a fee percent damage boost for three turns. Which is, um, it's not bad. It's definitely, I mean, I, I mean no it's, one's it's gonna always going to hit, by the way. Like, right. all the heal moves are always going to hit. But since he does have better damage buffs, I would not use this to buff his damage. I would definitely only use this when I need to remove tortures from my allies. No, I'm pretty sure it's a really good damage buff, honestly. Well, yeah, but um, there's also double. He has blackberry cake, which is double damage. Well, it's it's good to have multiple damage options. That's and, true. That's true. And this one, you can also run this one because it's uh less energy, less cooldown. Mm -hmm. But and it'll, but I'm running this one because it removes all tortures. Like my enemy, right. um, they might be getting possessed, and mm -hmm. uh, this also, and he also has regen moves too. So. Right. Now keep in mind, uh, this this uh, skill set here is mostly geared towards uh, less towards healing and more just removing uh, effects. This is this is geared for like a denier slash um, yeah. support role, and um, I only got one room spot and I put his team life, and that does that actually is really good. It's team level seven, it's eighty one thousand, and um, yeah. 
uh, he has two rune spots, one for trap and one for element, and um, these are really good rune spots because if you ever need relic spots, yeah. <laughs> and um, if you ever need stamina, you already know traps are the best way to get stamina. Mm -hmm. And um, amulets are also really good for just like putting like armor and stuff, you know. And yeah. uh, that's basically all I have to say about uh, Barrymore. So, I feel like we should test him out in yeah. the Abyss Department. So for this, so for this team, we have Duke Shrimp Waiter, who is one of the best attackers in the game. So uh, Blackberry more Blackberry is going to be very useful for um, giving him damage, so that he can like really shine. And because um, Duke, Sh I'm gonna get we're gonna do a Duke Shrimp Bar video eventually. Yes. But he has a little low life. He has low life, mm -hmm. so he would be able to give regen and take away tortures and controls. Right. Which could, and, which, which could save your best attacker, or your only attacker in this case. And uh, Master Sparky um, is actually Master Golf Golfield, I named some. Uh, I got him up to rank 2, and he he would take away positive effects, traits, and especially a tall monster you might have a regular trait. He's pretty good for my team, he's got like a support damage. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're gonna run it. Alright, let's see what we get. This guy has actually a good team. Hanser is a good attacker, not the best. Right. Uh, this this guy's pretty mid, but he he looks pretty cool. Um, th he's really good though because he is immune to control, which um, uh, Duke Shrimpwater has a ton of. Yeah. And he also does control, but if nice. Black Barrymore is good, then we can just remove the control. Yep. It would be even better if he had AOE dodge, but you know we can't all. We can't have everything. Yeah. Uh, who starts first? We start first. I'm gonna do, uh, I'm gonna do very bravely, so he gets his trait disabled. We can now do, um, I'm gonna do double damage here, and then probably, let me see, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do yes. this, because it removes all positive effects. They don't have any positive effects, but if it did, it would've been really good, and, um, it's gonna knock them out. Kill the one guy. Okay, now do energy channeling, take away all the negative things. Uh, I'm gonna give up. I'm gonna give him a uh, nail virus, and I'm just gonna kill. Uh, I'm gonna get him gone with some four stops drowned, and he's dead. And stats specs really one of the best, uh, like best friend in this game, basically. Yeah, but it also could be the enemy's best friend or your worst enemy, which which is definitely one of the areas where Blackberry shines. Um. So um, honestly, he's pretty good support slash denier. He's not the best monster, but for a past monster recently, there's been that good in past monsters. But he's really good. Mm -hmm. he, he, if you're just getting, if he's like your first mythic support, then I would, I mean, I would definitely I would take definitely him. Because yeah, yeah. mm -hmm. he's he's not the worst, but he's also not the best. Um, I would probably just give him a six or seven. Mm -hmm. He's he's really good, Maybe but he's, he's also not as good as Shelly. We already did a video on him. You mean, you I mean, mean Turtle, Turtle Myrtle? Myrtle. <laughs> yeah. I just called him Shelly. So, but Turtle reason. Myrtle is also a tank monster, so it's a little different. Um, but Turtle Myrtle is really is a really great tank monster, so I would check out the video on him. And yeah, that's that's pretty much it. You only have six days to click battle pass, by the way, so you should you should be grinding for the chest. Oh, this is the one for Turtle Myrtle. Yeah, the legend pass. Is the, the battle one. pass is the one for Turtle Myrtle legend pass. Yeah. And. You should be um you should be grinding for these chests which give you a ton of his cells. The I best chest for this is obviously the last chest, this one uh, not that one actually. Uh the one all the way over here. Right. Um, I missed it. Oh uh, yeah, here. It gives you two hundred which will rank you up. But if you had to choose, I would definitely do the battle pass instead of the legends pass, because I believe Turtle Myrtle will be a better uh, pick because Turtle Myrtle is a really good tank as opposed to um, Blackberry, who's just a, a kind of mid um, support. So, but if you don't have a support and already have like, a, a really good tank, then I would go for Blackberry. Yeah, Blackberry is really good, and that's it for today's video. We'll see you guys later.